quarter to two in the morning found Loudon firefighters back at 133 Ricker Road for a fire in the former junkyard. We had an RV on fire, a uh, trailer section from a tractor trailer, second RV, a couple of cars. And there was also a brush fire. Wednesday afternoon, firefighters had been called to the home for a brush fire that burned about a half acre. The homeowner did have a small outside fire that got away from them. And I believe that was uh, the whole situation there. The chief says they soaked the area and thought everything was out. Apparently overnight, it rekindled. We checked really thoroughly, but it's so dry out, it wouldn't take much. The fire overnight would eventually go to three alarms. And it wasn't just the fire firefighters had to worry about. There were several smaller explosions probably caused from tires blowing up from the heat. Fortunately, no firefighters were injured by the explosions. But one of the first firefighters on the scene was taken to the hospital. We worked really hard. It's a warm night. He got overheated, probably dehydrated. That firefighter is expected to make a full recovery. Then finally, some four and a half hours after firefighters arrived, the fire, which burned about an acre, was declared under control. Despite the fact that some rain is heading our way, fire officials are urging everyone to be extremely careful with fire because of the dry conditions. Reporting live in Loudon, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.